Welcome back to Crypto Torah. On today's video, I would like to discuss Litecoin and how it's currently performing. But before doing so, I would highly appreciate if you could give me a like down below and as well uh, subscribe if you're liking the content so far. So thank you very much already and let's get started. On the Litecoin compared to Bitcoin chart, you can clearly see definitely on the daily time frame that we have been in a major downtrend. You are clearly seeing that a lower high structure still in place. So that is something that I think is absolutely important right now for the overall strength of Litecoin as well. You can clearly see that if we take a look at the overall strength during the past couple of years, you can clearly see that the strength has never been so low compared to Bitcoin. I think that is absolutely important. And what I think actually it is telling us that Litecoin has still a lot of potential in the long run and and that we could perhaps see major increase from now on. So let's zoom in to where we are currently at. And if we take a look at Litecoin's price action, you can clearly see something I think is very important and that has been clearly shown previously is that we have to be able to break out above the moving averages. All three moving averages are right now on top of the current strength and are serving as major levels of resistance above us once we broke out above these levels found support on top of it we saw a major increase in litecoin strength compared to bitcoin that is for sure something i think that will occur once again but you have to take into consideration that the 67 percent increase will only occur once again once we see litecoin break out above the moving averages that is something i would like to for sure show you right now as well on the fibonacci you can clearly see that if we break out below the one fibonacci level that we might perhaps see an even further decline in strength compared to bitcoin personally i think that it will be very unlikely but for sure it's something you will have to consider due to the fact that underneath there is almost no previous data and therefore we might see a major breakdown towards the 1.618 fibonacci level compared to bitcoin this is the only thing i wanted to discuss on the litecoin compared to bitcoin chart due to the fact that i think it is very important to break out above the moving averages before we will be able to gain even more strength and as well see the price action increase exponentially towards the upside let's take a look at litecoin compared to usd on the daily time frame and as well over here i have drawn this fibonacci retracement unfortunately we are as well on the daily time frame compared to us dollar underneath the moving averages at this point in time i think it is also very good if we are able to break out above those moving averages find support on them and see afterwards the continuation of the current uptrend what i think is important right now is that if you take a look at the overall trend you can clearly see that we are creating once again lower highs on litecoin that is something that does concern me right now due to the fact that we have to be able to break out above this trend to see major increase during the upcoming weeks and perhaps days and lastly i would like to discuss that what i think is important is that we do still have major important levels of support and resistance underneath us and those were clearly serving as major levels of support for example at the 149 dollars we clearly saw at this point in time that we got supported and that was as well a major level of resistance previously and as well a major level of support once we broke out above it and before breaking out below it we were able to find support on top of it as well clearly in the past something very similar occurred this being said i would like to disable the moving averages i would like to enable the ema ribbon you can clearly see the EMA ribbon has been broken through. We are right now trading underneath it. And what I think is of utmost importance is to be able to actually break out above it as soon as possible before the shorts take over the longs. Otherwise, we might experience some major momentum towards the downside. And we could perhaps see, once again, Litecoin heading towards the 0 0.786 direction on the Fibonacci retracement at $132. This being said, I would like to enable the MACD on the daily time frame and you can clearly see something that i think is very good to know is that the strength of the downward momentum is declining therefore it is probable that we will eventually see a crossover here on the macd and as well the momentum waves towards the upside starting to increase but before this will even occur we have to take a look at the MACD as well on the four hourly time frame. Clearly over there, we are seeing actually the opposite like here. We are losing the upward strength and a crossover is perhaps inevitable over here. Therefore, we might see 
once again a retest of the 0 0.618 so finding support on top of it as we have done during the past couple of hours and perhaps being able to hold strong on top of that level if bitcoin does see a major increase litecoin will of course eventually see an increase as well but right now i'm saying that litecoin does not look very strong to me due to the fact that if we break out below the 0 0.618 and especially below the level of Fibonacci, I showed you the one level of Fibonacci on the Litecoin compared to Bitcoin chart, we might see a major breakdown in its strength and as well a major decline compared to the US dollar. So you have to take that into consideration. This being said about the MACD, something I would like to discuss as well is that we are fortunately trading on top of a previous level of resistance. But what I think is even more important is that we, if we re-enter the 0.5 level of Fibonacci, we traded actually right on top underneath and inside of this level for quite a while. If this does occur, I think it is very likely that we are going to see the trend getting reversed and that will be for sure of utmost importance for the overall price action. But what do we have to take into consideration before this occurs on the Litecoin chart? So right now, you can clearly see that we are retesting this downward sloping resistance line this downward sloping resistance line is for sure a confirmed resistance line we have seen multiple touch points one at the beginning and several ones in the middle of this area once we try to break out above it but we weren't able to do so right now it is important to be able to break out above this downward sloping resistance finding support on top of it because only then we might perhaps find enough strength to be able to create a trend reversal go even further up and find support on top of the 0 0.5 level accumulate for a while before heading even further lastly i would like to take a look at the rsi and the money flow index on the money flow index you can clearly see that we are heading towards that overbought area that is quite unfortunate due to the fact that we might perhaps not have enough strength to actually see a major increase right now getting started but we are not spotting anything out of the ordinary so therefore i think it is very good if we stay on top of the 50 area the market is still overall in profits and that would be very good for litecoin just for the current moment as well if we take a look at the rsi you can clearly see that we are underneath the 50 but of our utmost importance is we are not spotting any type of bullish or bearish divergences and therefore that is very good overall especially due to the fact that we still have a long way to go before we are heading towards that overbought area on the rsi and a trend reversal might occur at that point in time so that is something that does actually relieve me that we still have quite a long way to go before heading towards that overbought area on the rsi on the four hourly time frame as well on the rsi something you might have noticed on the rsi is actually very important and that is that we are still in this downtrend and that is something i think is very important due to the fact that we have to be able to break out above this downward sloping resistance on the rsi to see a major trend reversal occur of course right now litecoin overall the structure is looking quite bearish and the strength compared to bitcoin is not holding very strong but what i must admit is that litecoin has a lot of potential in the future and therefore right now i am not completely sad about this i personally think if we are heading towards a retest of this area at the 0 0.786 for sure it will be bad for the overall market strength but it depends as well a lot on bitcoin but if we perhaps would see a retest of this zone over here and afterwards a trend reversal getting created this major point in time at 132 dollars is for me clearly the must accumulation area where i will be purchasing litecoin once more because i think it is very unlikely afterwards that we are going to fall even further towards the downside due to the fact that i must admit that bitcoin will for sure eventually start once again trading towards the upside so thank you very much for the attention right now i really hope you enjoyed the video and as well lastly i would like to ask you to follow me down below on twitter at thorough crypto where you will be kept up to date about all upcoming videos once again thank you and have a nice day bye bye I'm the new Warren B, be the ship's nemesis. When we go to Mars, I just hope that he remembers this. Used to shop on Binance, now they got a chance.